Now we are going to go and learn how to do the individual features. How to draw the eyes, how to draw the nose, how to draw the mouth, how to draw the ears, all these things. Eyes will be in a straight line. If the face is tilted, the if the face is like that, the eye line will be like that. If the face is tilted, the eye line will also tilt. Always remember that the eye line will tilt. Now we are going for the measurements of the eyes. There will be an eyes distance between the two eyes. Then we draw a rectangle which is not at all parallel for the eyes. The inside of the eye will be smaller line and the outside will be longer line. Then we curve it out. We draw two more curves for the eye hood and the circle that we draw for the iris will be touching the top of the eye hood. Then we draw the pupil leaving out a little bit of highlight. We darken it. The eyebrow, like the eye, the inside will be longer, the outside will be shorter, the hair will be going in one direction. Now drawing the nose. We draw a V, draw two small horizontal lines and draw two verticals to show the nostril. Then we draw an open box. Then we curve out the lines and add a little bit of detail. Now we draw the lips. The plumb line from the center of the eye will show the extremes of the lips. And then we draw two V's for the upper lip and connect the ends. We have the lower lip. We draw the curves. The ears on the side view is a C and another C hanging from down and we draw the ridges. This is the front view for the ear. This is the profile for the nose and a three-fourth. When we are asking the students to do these exercises, we will have to tell them that this drawing doesn't come out perfectly well in the first shot. They will have to keep practicing following the method. We told what the method is, so they will have to follow the method. With practice comes perfection. We will draw the profile of the eye, two diagonals and a semicircle for the pupil. Leave a highlight and darken it. That's the three-fourth of an eye. That's the profile of lips and that's the three-fourth of the lips.